So I know some of you are like me and you like those Mark Dice Trump shirts. I figured I'd give a little review. I've had uh, a couple of shirts since I believe October. That was around my birthday. And uh, I figure I'll show you how they've held up. Well, I just want to show you first though. This shirt is from way back during the first year of Trump. So it's lasted. I've worn it a lot, okay? And then what we got here. Oh, ain't he so cute? So what we got here. Uh, I believe this is another Mark Dice shirt. And it's holding up pretty well. You see there's a little bit of flaking. And this is two months old also. Here's a Mr. Ballin shirt. This, I believe, is over a year old. It's holding up really well. I know, buddy. I'll give you another treat. Don't worry. So those are holding up really well, right? This one. Look at this. And by the way, I, I love Mark Dice. He's awesome. If you want to support the cause, totally do it. But if if you're, you know, got to be real savvy with your money, I'd be a little weary because you might end up with a messed up shirt. And not only that, but when we put in the code for like, what, 20% off, it never gave us 20% off. So that's actually pretty crappy when you think you're going to get a deal and you don't. Oh, let me fix this. There we go. Okay. Look at that. Now it just says wanted. It's like, geez. So I think, sadly, see how it's all flaking off. Like I said, it's only been two months since we've had this. So I'll probably reuse it and put like, <laughs> put uh, like one of those printable uh, t-shirt iron-on things on there and make it my own shirt. You know, do it inside out. But yeah, it's it's kind of crappy to wear this now because it just says wanted. And you can see it says Trump. And it doesn't say Trump for president. So, I don't know. It is uh, it is what it is, but you gotta, you gotta think twice before you order something sometimes, you know. If you're like me at least where you gotta kind of be savvy with your money.